So you know, this is not the United States going into Iraq to try and remake Iraq or going into Afghanistan to try and remake Afghanistan. This is the Ukrainians standing up for themselves and just saying, help us. And I think that, that fundamentally and morally really changes the equation in the way that we view the war. Because you know, there are no American troops on the ground there. There are not Americans going in there to try and sort this out. This is, we can see these are the Ukrainians fighting valiantly to save themselves. I mean, I wrote a piece in The Atlantic. I actually think this is, I hope, the future of American warfare. You know, the future of American intervention is not to be interventionist like it has been for a long time. It's you only intervene if people are willing to fight for themselves. And I think right. that's, that's a key important. distinction. I, I just want to say, I think the difference between us going in and this being... Uh, you, you know, Ukrainian self-determination, it's a lot easier to line up morally and ethically behind self-determination of a nation like Ukraine, <clears throat> particularly against an aggressor like like Russia. Absolutely. I mean, this is an anti-imperial war. Ukraine is being invaded. There is arguably a form of genocide that is trying to be attempted against the Ukrainian people. And the Ukrainians simply want to have their country, which is internationally recognized. You know, they're not asking for anyone else's territory. They're just asking for their land, which according to the UN, this is the land of Ukraine. And so it, it's the opposite, you might say, of the way we've come to look at as imperial um, occupations or imperial forces. This is anti-imperial. So the United States is fighting an anti-imperial war at this time. And I think that has percolated down to the political debate on quite a profound level that people say this is a war I can I can support because it isn't one um, where the United States is trying to rule the world. It's actually one where the Ukrainians are trying to stand up for themselves.